Hey everybody, this is Jonathan Liguori over at Neolife Physical Therapy, and we're doing a few exercises that are targeting tennis elbow or lateral epicondylitis, which is tendonitis of the wrist extensor muscle group. And right here, what you're seeing is a dumbbell wrist extension. And what he's doing there is he's going nice and slow through that range of motion to make sure he's strengthening it through the concentric or shortening and the eccentric or lengthening portions of the exercise. Then right here he's doing what's known as ulnar and radial deviation. And here's wrist flexion. And not only do you want to make sure that the wrist extensor group is, str is strong, but you want to make sure that all facets of the elbow into wrist controlling muscles are strong together. So here you see what are just called smiles and frowns. So he's got a flex bar and he's just trying to slow and control both concentrate on the eccentric and concentric portions of the exercise, taking it nice and slow through each motion. Now he's doing what can be called either ringing or twisting. And it's just another way to make sure that all those muscles from the forearm, throughout the forearm into the wrist are strong in unison. And this last one right here is a stretch of the wrist extensor group. So you see that she's not only bending her hand down, but she's also bringing it outward. And what that does is it really isolates that group of muscles together. And that'll do it for our exercises for tennis elbow or lateral epicondylitis. Thanks for joining us and we'll see y'all next week for some more exercise specific routines.